Hey guys, me Mr. Casual, and in this video we're gonna be doing a fight reaction to um Israel Adesanya versus Alex Bejeda two um in the UFC. Um, but before we get into it, ninety five percent of you guys are not subscribed. If you guys could please subscribe, help support the channel. I would really, really appreciate it. Right, so let's get into it then. Holy crap, guys! Like, oh my god, I I did not see that coming, especially not in the second round. Like. Izzy was playing possum, blah, blah, blah. They threw the overhand right, and he fought Pajeda, and it didn't even look like it really, like, caught him like that. And then he threw the overhand right again, and then, like, kind of clipped him with, like, a left underhand hook. It was, like, a somewhat of, like, an uppercut. I'm like... And then, and then when Pajeda dropped, bro, I was, like, like, like in shock. I was, like, in disbelief. I was, I was like, this, you should see my face. I was, like, a, like, I was, like, 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 mind fucked. Like, I knew Izzy had a chance. Don't get me wrong. These guys are so good, at, and they're such a high level. Even though Izzy's, you know, lost 0-3, and three, I knew that Izzy eventually beat Pajeda. There was a couple of close calls where Izzy actually, you know, did pretty good against Pajeda. Especially in the last fight, I think. I forgot what round it was. It was like second or third round. Like, Pajeda got rocked, and the bell rang or whatever. So, I knew, I knew Izzy, like, had a chance, right? Like, a lot of people were saying Izzy was about to get smoked, whatever. But I knew Izzy, bro. Izzy's still Izzy, bro. Like, even though... But a lot of people are saying, like, you know, Pajeda is like Izzy's kryptonite, which I can understand that he is. He was like Izzy's kryptonite. But the thing was, I was like, bro, I don't know, bro. Something seems different about Izzy. But I honestly did not see Izzy winning like that. Like, like straight up flatline KO in the second round. I did not see that coming at all. Honestly, I, I'm, I'm going to be honest, bro. I thought maybe Izzy. I, I honestly thought for some reason it was going to go to like the fourth or fifth round if something were to happen or maybe decision or something like that. You know what I mean? I figured Izzy was going to fight super safe and maybe win like a decision or something like that. Or if he was going to win, maybe something like a TKO early stoppage in the fourth or fifth round. I did not see Izzy winning KO second round, but holy shit. Wow. Now there has to be a fucking trilogy fight. There has to be a trilogy fight. That shit was so sick. Yo, tell me, yo, yo, tell me, leave, leave a comment. Let me know if you guys were also as shocked as I was when, when Izzy like completely KO'd Alex Bahada in, in the end of the second round. Like, tell me if, if you guys were as shocked as me. You know, am I the only one that's just like so fucking like in disbelief what, what the fuck I just seen? Like, I, I, I mean, I know the fight just happened, so I'm like still have that general shock. You know, but I was like, yo, fucking, I might as well make the video right after the fight ha happened. Was, that shit was crazy. There was a lot of good fights on the card. I'm not going to lie. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to react to all the fights tomorrow. I got to go to work early in the morning. I actually wasn't going to do this video until, like, um tomorrow because I have to go to work at, like, 7 a.m. But I was like, you know what, fuck, I'm going to make this one video, the, the Izzy versus Mahata reaction. I'm like, holy shit. I was, like, so fucking, that shit was so crazy. Oh, my God. Now there has to be a trilogy, and let's say Izzy wins that. Uh, bro, that you. Oh my God, I give Izzy all the credit in the world. I actually like Izzy's speech, and I like that Izzy actually gave like a pound to Behater. You know, so I wonder if there's. You know what? I wonder if there's gonna be any more shit talk between them. I doubt it, right? Because now that Izzy finally beat Behater and he actually knocked Behater out, I don't think him and Behater are gonna be going back and forth. I think now they finally have. They've been having like a mutual respect, but I know I think they definitely gonna have some shitload of respect for each other now. You know. And, and bro, and I'm sure like ninety percent of people thought Izzy was done. Izzy, that's it. Um, Pajeda was Izzy's kryptonite. I know 90% of people. I saw the YouTube comments. I saw the YouTube videos. Bro, nobody thought Izzy had any chance at all. Right? I guarantee there's going to be a lot of people right now that are like, oh, I knew Izzy had a chance. I knew Izzy had a chance. Bro, I was reading those comments in the YouTube. I'm like, yo, a lot of people thought he didn't. You know? But the thing is, you, we, we have to understand this, bro. Pajeda and Izzy are literally, like, at the top. When you're at that level... Everyone at the like top three can pretty much beat each other. I feel like, you know, when people are that good, when fighters are that good, that level, they, they like, you know, if they fight ten times, I'm sure they could beat each other at some point, right? If every if if, if Izzy, let's say like um certain fighters and who are in the top three fight each other ten times, I'm sure they can beat each other a couple of times, right? It just depends who has a who has a good day. Anyone that plays sports knows there's certain days, or people have good days. Some people have bad days. It's a thing. Like it really is a thing. You know, some people have good days, some people have bad days. Depends what, you know, when you play sports, like some days you're on fire, some days you're you're not feeling it. It just depends whether the good day is he. Bro, it is he was, bro, he was playing possum. He was all covered up and he was getting lit up. And then all of a sudden he did that and got him. I'm like, holy shit. Bro, oh my God, I'm still, I'm still in shock, guys, as you can see. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, It's me, Mr. Casual. Remember, 95% of you guys are not subscribed. If you guys could please subscribe to us with the channel, I would really, really appreciate it. Holy fuck, I'm just still mind blown with what the fuck Izzy just did. Holy shit, that was amazing to watch.
wow. The whole crowd, everybody was like, like fucking erupted. You know? I, I really hope there's a trilogy. I want to see the fucking trilogy, bro. Anyways, guys, me and Scott, uh, be, be safe, everybody. All right? Take care.